you hear me okay? I can, and, uh, and share the screen with you so that everybody can see you as well as hear you. you say, All right, yeah. Let me know if you can see my screen okay. Yeah, here we go. All right. All right, everyone, can you see his screen? Let's see. Let me put it on show my screen. I see you. Is that good? You can see me? All right, everybody's saying yes in the uh, in the chat box, so I think awesome. we're good to go. <laughs> and I see a lot of a lot of familiar names in the uh, in the uh, chat box, so I'm real, real excited. And thank you, Tammy. I, I appreciate the introduction and really excited about sharing some value. Now, if you guys have been on my webinars before, uh, even if you've been on the no, I, I did a no pressure webinar uh, several months back. Uh, I'm going to be covering a lot of different material today. In fact, it's almost like a holistic approach I'm going to be working with you on. I, I had a nice conversation with Matt, and he uh, he loves the product. He had asked me to to to, to share some more information, some more uh, of what's working for me. Uh, as Tammy was saying, I'm actually a promoter as well as one of the coaches. So the the things that I coach people about, the things I help them with, I do myself. So and it's just been absolutely amazing. So, um, and, and, and Tammy, you said everybody can hear me okay, right? The, the, I know they can see my screen. Can they hear me okay? Because uh, I can't pull, up, pull open the chat feature. Can you just double check and make sure they can hear me okay? Yep, yeah, I've got everybody saying yes, they can hear you, so awesome. we're good. All right, perfect. And Tammy's going to be my right-hand person here, so <laughs> she'll, be, uh, she'll be manning the chat. So, uh, uh, I'm, I'm going to try and get everything knocked out, guys, in about an hour, 45 minutes an hour. I know that we've got people all over the world that are taking the time out. So I am here to help you guys take your business to another level and really want to deliver for you. So let's just go ahead and get started. So again, today we're going to be talking about how to increase your uh, MTTB, uh, MLR conversion with the traffic and leads that you're already getting now, but also with the no pressure, no sweaty palm approach, okay? So um, one thing about me is I love to I, I love working with Mo Partners. That's one of the joys that I truly have. Um, I am here to serve you. Okay? I'm here to give you 120%. Let me know if I don't, okay? But if I do that, I want to make sure that you guys can reciprocate and participate if I do so, okay? All right. So do I, can y'all y'all raise your hand up? Give me a little hand raise. Let me if that's if that's a good trade off for me to give my all as long as you guys can participate. Are we get a lot of people raising their hands, Tammy? Yep. Yes, we do. Awesome. Uh -huh. All right, guys. Perfect. I am ready to go. And also, I would do I have your permission to freestyle. <laughs> and when I say freestyle, I'm not talking about rapping. I'm not going to start singing and rapping, but I do get, I tend to get excited uh, from time to time and I may go down a, a path, which I think may help you. I was telling Tammy, I don't really work out a, a slide by slide script. Um, I really sometimes I even get a, a, a little bit of feedback uh, if, because if you have questions throughout the presentation, make sure that you let Tammy know. Uh, we're not going to have time for questions at the end, so if you have questions that are relevant to what we're covering, then make sure that you can put them in there. She'll try to get to as many as we can within the hour, um, but I I mean, I want to try and, and deliver, so sometimes I go a little bit off to the side. So did they say yes to that, Tammy? Do I have permission? <laughs> Is that okay to go freestyling? <laughs> <laughs> yes, they're saying. Okay, yes. perfect, perfect. <laughs> uh, they're probably happy I'm not going to sing. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and get started. So, so guys, if you stick with me to the end, okay, if you stick with me to the end, because guys, this is going to be 95% content. Uh, you're going to learn things today that's going to transform your business. And I know it's a bold claim. Part of it, a big part of it has you to do with implementation also, and I'm going to talk about that in a few minutes. But if you stick with me, this is what's going to happen. You're going to discover what every partner should be doing with their business. Every Mo partner should be doing this, okay? You're also going to see how this is very intuitive, okay? I'm not going to be speaking over your heads and, and like, you know, using fancy, uh, you know, trigonometry or algebraic type equations. No, this is, should fall in line with things that are your, you know, that you're doing on a daily basis should be very intuitive, should make sense, okay? You're going to just also discover on today's webinar um, a way to get out of your comfort zone, 
okay, or what you need to do to get out of that comfort zone. Um, also, I'm going to show you about what I something I call the one percent rule or the one percent expert rule. That's also going to make a big shift in the way that you think. And, and, and then and right at the end, I'm going to talk about a special offer that can literally change your mo business overnight. Literally, can change it overnight. Okay. So, um, so who is this webinar for? Okay. So who is it for? Uh, let me let me do this. I'm going to move. Uh, I'm going to move this little thing out of the way. There we go. Okay. I'm going to come back. Here. Let's see. Okay. So, who is the webinar for? Okay. It, it, this is for people that are just starting out. Okay. So, if you're just starting out, you know, you've gone through the steps and you kind of don't, you know, you know that you need to start promoting, but you don't know exactly what you need to get going. Well, this webinar is for you. If you've already been in a MOB, because I noticed that we have, you know, a MOB license partners, we have Titanium, we have Platinum, we even have some Diamond partners that are on the call. Well, if you've been in MOB and you're getting leads and opt-ins, but you're not getting them converted to MTTBs, well, this is for you. If you're getting MTTBs, but you're not getting the conversion to those upper levels, you're going to benefit from this also. <coughs> Excuse me. And if you just want to learn how to talk to people and maybe use the, 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 the top tier income product that we have, even if you don't want to, if you just want to learn how to talk to people, this webinar is for you, okay? So, you know, almost everybody on this call or everybody on this call should get some value from what we're going to cover, all right? So I don't want to spend a whole lot of time on my story. Uh, if if you, you guys have followed me or know, you know, Matt, you know, you know, shares a lot about me uh, throughout the videos. Uh, if you come to Masterminds, you get a chance to meet me. So I don't, I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time on this because I want to get to the content. But I, I love showing this picture because I always tell people the first thing that you need to do when you get started, you know, in Mobis, you have to develop your why. You have to find a why, and that is going to keep you focused and going in the right direction to get your business to where you want it to get. Now, my why is my family. Okay, I've, I've got a beautiful wife, uh, Nancy, and, and two awesome kids, uh, Ashley and Austin, and we get to travel. Okay, one of, and my children are homeschooled, so they, they live the laptop lifestyle like I do. So we travel to all the masterminds. Hopefully, if some of you guys are going to be coming to Phuket in November, I'll get a chance to meet you because I'm bringing my whole family to that event. So we pretty much go to every mastermind, but that is my why. I and mean, these are the places we've traveled. Um, I've also been able to participate in the Mo Motors program. And uh, if you actually go to mobmotors.com, you can actually see my family. I, I live in Sugar Land, which is right outside of Houston. Uh, I was telling Tammy that's a real place. Sorry, I didn't make it up. It is a real place, Sugar Land, Texas. Um, and this is a great program that Matt has, and you know we've been able to get a, a free car that he's paying for for our family. And you know if you go to mobmotors.com, you can see a little bit more about my family. Um, I have made amazing connections, and little did I know when I joined in 2012 how much my life would change. Um, you know they always say that your your net worth is always linked to your network. And that's part of how you're going to get successful in MOBE, is, is coming to Mastermind, coming to events and meeting people. And I am really good friends with most of the top incomers in the, in, in the company, and that's helped my business also. I've also been able to share uh, my knowledge and, and help people out by speaking from different stages all over the world. You know, I've been in this place in Texas, in Bali, in London. Um, I love love sharing this message. So so that's just a little bit about me. And you know, like I said, if you go to mobmotors.com, you can see a little bit more about, about uh, my family and really what's driven me and gotten me to this point. So here's what I want everyone to take a 30 second, I'm going to give you a little exercise. I'm going to have you doing things right out of the gate. Okay, I want everyone to do this now. One of my biggest pet peeves, a lot of times when I'm speaking from stage is, is, is when I see this happening a lot. But during webinars, I know people sometimes tend to go to several webinars where you go to different uh, events. <clears throat> you'll get excited. You'll get a lot of information and content. And then it will sit on your desk or in your iPad or somewhere gathering dust, and you'll never see it again. So here's what I want everyone to take a moment to do now. Now, I use Google Calendar, but you can use whatever calendar doc. If you're not using an online calendar, use a, a desk calendar, whatever, or just write down a note to yourself. I want you to put two events into your calendar, okay? This is the first event. I want you to set aside at least 30 minutes, okay, for you to review 
the notes that you're taking from to, from this webinar. Okay? So I want you to schedule a 30-minute block where you are going to review the notes from this webinar. Then I want you to take another 30-minute block another day, and I want you to write implementation of TG's webinar. Okay? Does that make sense? Does everybody follow me? Is everybody, are we getting uh, people saying that it makes sense and that they're doing it? In fact, once you do it, just put, I did it, into the chat box so Tammy can see. <clears throat> just put, I did it, into the chat box. Okay, done doing it. Okay, perfect. <laughs> did it. Did Good. it. Because, guys, I want you guys to get mass value from this, and I don't want you just to get excited during this hour we're together. I want this to change your business. I mean, one of the frustrations I have as a coach is, you know, I'll work with people, I'll give them all this information and say, listen, just do it. And then later on, they'll say, well, I haven't made the money that I thought I was going to make. Well, did you do these things that I laid out for you? Oh, no, I didn't do any of those things. Or I just did one of those things, okay? So implementation, guys, is a big part, okay? So I do this pretty much on every webinar, every time I speak, I say, put these two things in, all right? So implement, I mean, review. Review your notes, and then implementation, okay? All right, so I think that's I've given everybody enough time. If you haven't got a chance to do it, write in bold letters or highlighter on your notes right now to make sure that you can do this, okay? All right, let me get back on this. All right, so the, the company's going through explosion, okay? We are, I mean, I, I'm in the Mac office. I have meetings with our division managers and, and Matt very frequently, and our sales are going in an amazing direction. Sales, you know, uh, you know, not just from our phone sales, but also from our event sales. So the companies went in the right direction. But the one thing that I want to talk about, because you know, I mean, I've got a product I'm talking about a little later called a No Pressure Sales System. You know, sales itself. I mean, I've been in sales for 25 years, uh, part time, full time, at different junctures, and sales itself has a very, very negative connotation to it, okay? In fact, when you hear sales, you know, I, I just want you to, th what do you honestly think of when you think about sales? I mean, you hear somebody say sales. Do you think of this guy? Does this guy come to mind when you think about sales? So uh, let's see what some of the people are writing, Tammy. When you think about sales, what do you guys, do you think about this guy, right? This is a good picture of what you think about, or what, if you have one word or two words, what, is coming to people's minds. Mary Lee says, uh, I agree. Sleazy, I see a lot of sleazy, manipulative. Yep. <laughs> Damn. Um, anything to make a buck, a car salesman. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. And see, and see that's, and that's the thing. Well, that's one of the reasons I put together this system is uh, when I first got into sales, that's really the way it was shown to me. And I always think there was, thought it was a disconnect. I always like to work and talk to people the way I like to be spoken to, okay? So, so you're going to see that this is that's something we just don't do, all right? We don't do anything like this, okay? So, and, and so a, a part of the reason I'm showing this is sometimes people say, well, I'm not a salesperson. I don't know how to do sales. But part of it is because psychologically they make a link to this type of guy. And we're going to show you that you don't really even have to look at yourself as a salesperson, but I'm going to show you what you can do now to make more money without spending thousands of dollars more in traffic and all these other things. I want to show you what you can do with what you have now. And if you don't have it now, I'll, I'll give you a couple of ideas. I don't want to get too sidetracked on that path, but I want to give you a couple of ideas. Um, but there are way, there, there's a, many, many ways for you to find ways to get leads coming in. But I'm going to show you ways to get those and do something with it that's going to transform your business. So, so I want you to think about things a little differently. I want you to, because when people tell me that they're not a salesperson, you know, I tell people, listen, if you are in a relationship, if you're married, well, guess what? You sold that other person that you were good enough to be married to, right? Right? So if you have children and, you're, and you get your children to do something, well, they're buying what you're selling. There's a reason that they're doing it. So the, 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 you have to change that vision that, okay, I'm not a salesperson per se, because you, you really are. You truly are if you look at it. I'm going to show you a way without sweaty palms, without you know getting a heart attack. Oh, my gosh, I, I've got to talk to people. I'm going to show you how you can do it in a very, very non-threatening, no-pressure way. So I want you to change the way that you look at this overall, okay?
So, so one of the things I hear when I'm when I'm coaching students, uh, you know, I mean, I'm a level two coach, so I do business plans. So when I when I get to uh, the 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 students, they're like, oh, okay, I, I need to get to traffic. I need to learn about traffic for my business, right? So who has been told that traffic is the key to online success? Raise your hand if you've been told that the key to trap, I mean, the uh, online success is traffic. We're getting a lot of hands raised there, Tammy. Let's see here. Oh yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So traffic is key to online success. You know, so I mean, if you look at it as a post-it, you know, you can stick it right on your desk. Most people are told, boom, get more traffic. Get more traffic. That's the, that's the key. That is the key to making money in Mobe. That's the key to making money in this and that. Get more traffic. Well, guys, I'm going to tell you right now, real bluntly, traffic is not the problem. It's not the issue. It is not the issue, okay? I mean, if you look at a big store like Macy's, you see all these people milling about in front of Macy's. Well, if all those people are walking in and they don't buy anything, well, is Macy's going to make any money? Right? So they're going to make money because they have a big a volume of people, but if you have a big chunk of people that just walk in and don't buy anything, well, that traffic was useless. So really, you have to get, you have to wrap your head around this, that traffic is not the key, guys. It is conversions. That's what's about. It's a conversion game. Now, we're going to help you as the phone team. You have the phone team that's going to help you, which for the average person, you know, that's great. You know, I've got this phone team helping me with conversions. But if you are having some issues with getting that front end to the phone team to start making calls, that's what I'm going to help you do today. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to take those leads you're getting and get them better converted. And I can almost guarantee you the majority of people on this call are approaching this the, the wrong way. And that's what I'm going to correct. I'm going to do a little bit of a correction today that's going to change your mo business okay and and I really I love meeting partners I want you to come out to me I'm at most events and I want you to tell me because I want everyone to implement and I want you to tell me listen TG this is what I did and this is what happened in my business I would love to hear those stories okay but get it out of your head drug traffic is the key where it is all about conversions so there's, <laughs> so there's two things that you need to provide to your future customers. There's two things. They almost go hand in hand, okay? And I'm sure most people have heard of these two things. I mean, one is value, right? And the other is content, okay? You have content and you have value. Content and value. And they're very related, okay? Because you're really going to get a lot of value or you're going to give value to your future customers, right? So, I mean, you might think, okay, what do you mean add value? I hear that all the time. Adding value. Well, what 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 does that mean, right? So you may be thinking, what what do you mean by adding value? What do you mean by you know bringing content into the picture? Okay. Well, I'm going to give you a little bit of a sneak peek of of something that I do, because what happens is there is a specific way that people think when they start graduating the 21 steps or start going through the program of of what they think they need to do. Okay. And I'm gonna I'm I'm, I'm gonna take and make a shift with that. So one of the things is like in one of the, I, I've got a lot of different front end products and a lot of opt-in pages, different things that I do. Um, but this is one of the ones that I use. Okay. So I will offer, you know, as for an opt-in, Hey, listen, if you opt in, I'm going to give these seven stealthy strategies. That's going to make your business 10 times more profitable. I am adding value to that person's life. I am not just saying, Hey, click here, join me. This is what I'm going to provide for you. If you give me your opt, if you opt in, this is what I'm going to provide. So once they give me their opt in, well then they're going to go to this fulfillment page, okay, where I'll show them seven quick and easy ways to instantly make you know make money, make more money out of their business. So this is just one way I am providing content and I'm providing value. Okay, I'm going to show. Uh, not really show because I don't have time to do all these examples within an hour, but I want you to see one. So I'm going to back it up just so you can see it one more time. Uh, I have to go a little quickly on that. Oops, let me see if I did that right. Okay, there we go. So again, this is the opt-in page that I'm using. Okay, so seven strategies. I mean, you can make something called five. You can make it a three. And we'll get to where you get this information from in just a minute, but I'm just giving you an example of what I do. 
So I use this to get people to, to, to join my list, and then I fulfill something that's going to change their life, that's going to add value. If they implement just one of these strategies, this can happen to you and your business. Okay? So that's just an example of what I mean by adding value, adding content. Now, this is what most partners do when they start with Mo. And you, you still may be doing this and, and may be wondering, wow, I'm, I'm not really sure why I'm not getting more people to, to, to join me. What you do is you give them, hey, click here and go to my MoBlink.com, okay? All right, I mean, it's a little facetious there, but that's pretty much what you do is you'll do a solo ad, you'll do Facebook, and, and you'll put your MTTB link. Let me just get rid of this again, that little screen. Okay, so does, does that make sense, guys? What, what, what most people are doing is they're just giving their link to join MTTB and then wondering, wow, I wonder why. I wonder why no one's joining my business. I wonder, I mean, I'm, I'm out there promoting I'm spending money, but I don't seem to be getting uh, a whole lot of sales. I'm getting all these opt-ins. People are opting in, but I'm not getting any sales, right? So, guys, you want to get out of this mindset of I need to go ahead and just get these clicks. So this is the way that I look at it, okay, just so you understand. This is the way that I look at it. Uh, imagine, I just want you to imagine that you are, you know, I don't know if people are married on this call or single, but let's say that you're in a dating situation. And you are asking somebody out for coffee. You know, coffee and dessert. Let's get together for coffee and dessert. At the end, there's a nice time that's being had, great conversation, good chemistry, maybe the start or something. And then at the end of the date, the, the guy goes, hey, will you marry me? Will you marry me on the first date? What do you, if somebody asks you, the first time, let's say that you are married, what, if somebody asks you to marry you on the first date, what would you think, guys? What are some, what are some things people are writing in the chat box, Tammy? <laughs> if you got that proposal. You ran her off. <laughs> say crazy stalker. <laughs> get lost. I would have had, had, had it tough because I'm from Philadelphia. My wife's from Houston. And we had a great time the first time. If I asked her to marry me after that first conversation, she would have sent me packing back to Philly, right? <laughs> yeah, I guys, thought that happened to me. It, it's kind of scary. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. But but this is what people do. This is what a lot of people do in internet marketing. They get excited about a company, and then all of a sudden, here's my link. Buy. Here's my link. Buy my forty nine dollar product right off the bat. Right? I mean, this guy could be the greatest guy in the world, and and he would just blow it, right? Because he asked her to marry, and you know, nobody's going to, I mean, you may have a, a few people, but for the majority, that's just not going to work. So there's a lot that happens to get that relationship going in the right direction. Now, the great thing about internet marketing, what we do with Moab, it's not going to take six months or a year or three years or five years like some people need to do to, to get to be married. It's a lot less of a time frame, but there is some time involved there. There is some time. You have to get to your, your, your people, your, your future customers, get to know you a little bit. So don't just give your link out right away. You want to find a way to get them to know, like, and trust you. If you guys heard of the KLT, it's you know, like, and trust because that's important. You have to get them to, to know that you are there to help them, right? So hopefully that's making sense to the people that we have on the call. Usually the, I, I usually I save my the, the quote till the end, but I want to stick it right in the middle because this is very important. The difference between who you are and who you want to be is what you do. I talked about implementation earlier, but this is what I'm talking about. Don't leave this webinar and go doing the same things you guys have been already doing if all you're doing is sticking your link in front of somebody's face to buy. Okay, because most people won't just buy on the first opportunity, and they're definitely not going to buy if they think you've been doing everything that the, the other people have been doing before you, right? So the difference between who you are and who you want is what you do. So do make some changes in what you do. So so here's what I tell people: um, I live in Sugarland, right? And uh, it's you know it's, it's it's a great community. It's growing. It's not not even close to being the size of Houston. 
but there's one stretch of, of Sugar Land where we have three McDonald's, three McDonald's, right, right near each other. They're not like on the next corner, but they're pretty close, probably within uh, a mile and a half, I'd say, of each other. So here's the thing. These McDonald's owners, they're not saying, you know what, we're all pretty close to each other. Let's all split the profits three ways. If we can do it three ways, I'd be totally happy, right? That's not what they do. Now, McDonald's does a lot of advertising for the brand, but the owners that maybe spend a little more time making sure that their the uh, the uh, uh, the store facade looks nice, maybe adding in a nicer play area, doing more specials. Those you know those things are going to help them maybe trump that we're having great customer service. That's going to help them trump those other McDonald's, right? Does that make sense, guys? So here's the analogy that I'm trying to make. I, one thing I love, or one of the main things I love about Mob is how supportive the environment is. And when I go to masterminds, there's so much people that are wanting to help the next person. But the, here's the thing. You are you are in a, I don't say competition, but you're trying to get that market share from the next guy. If everyone's doing it the same way by sticking their links in front of people and not providing value, not giving content that's going to change people's lives, don't expect people to join your business, right? So what you want to do is you want to find a way to take your business. And guys, this should be very intuitive. There's nothing that I'm going to that should be going over your heads. If you think about what I'm saying, it should make all the sense in the world to you. So, so does that make sense? Can you just put in the chat box, yes, it makes total sense, or I see, I see exactly what you're talking about. Are we getting comments like that, uh, yeah. Tammy? Yeah, TG, we have a lot that, say, that are saying yes, but I've got a couple people who are saying that um, putting the links in their email and then sending them out that way is kind of what they are taught at first when they first join, but then um, getting into relationship building isn't really addressed until they're in the program for a while. Okay, that's a great, great question. Now, again, I don't do the traffic coaching, um, but here's what I tell people with that because it's kind of like it, you know when you learn how to drive, or when you have your first kid, or you know when you're learning how to swim. Um, I can tell you till I'm blue in the face how it is to have a kid. It really is. Um, but until you have that child and you have sleepless nights, or you got to carry them around, rocking them to sleep. You're not going to know really what, what what that it's all about. Same thing about swimming, right? I can tell you how to do this and do that. that. You get thrown in the water. It's totally different. So it's really hard for uh, for us to tell you exactly what you need to do to have a flourishing business. In fact, if we tell the average person that's starting out, hey, these are all things you're going to need to do. Sometimes it could be a little bit overwhelming. Okay, so that's one of the reasons that things are taught in a certain way. Unfortunately, because of some unscrupulous, uh, you know, people on the internet, and again, this is not Mo people, but you know, with Facebook and some other uh, means of uh, of uh, traffic, um, direct linking is almost, you know, a, a banned almost anywhere you go. It's like you I mean you direct link and it comes back to Mo, but that's internet marketing. You know, what are we going to do? Well, here's what I tell people: you have to look at just the things that I've talked about. Okay. What I'm telling you is you are probably here because you saw some benefit, right? You saw a benefit in MOBE or the coaching or the support that you've never seen anywhere else or how big the company. There's something that you saw that was adding value to your life, and that's why you joined. Well, I'm just telling you to do the same thing for your future customers. That's what you want to do. You want to try to find a way to bring value to it. And I'm going to talk a little bit more about that in just a few minutes, but that's what I mean. So even though you were told that, you know, I'm not saying it was a bad thing to learn that because now you're going to learn quickly, oh, okay, I need to do something else because that didn't seem to be working. But intuitively, I think you can see why it wasn't working because you're just putting a link out there, and if they've seen that link before, what's the point of them joining if it's the same link with no difference? But guess what? I know people that have seen the MOB, MTTV business 10 times before and haven't joined. And then all of a sudden they joined because they started figuring out, wait a second, this person cares about me. I now see this in a different light, in a different manner. All right? So great point, great question.
but I want you to just listen to the to the rest of what I'm going to go over, and I want you to see if it all falls on and makes sense. Okay. So again, just bring value into people's lives, do s different things than the average person is doing to promote their business, and you're going to stand heads. I mean, you, you're going to shine. You're going to be able to uh, see things a lot differently. People are going to see you in a different light. So here's some things y'all can start doing today. These are things you can start doing today. Again, do not go for the easy click. Okay, so get it out of your mind. Get out of your mind that you're going to go for the easy click. You don't want to do that. Offer people immense value. Okay? So we have that word value again. So, so how do you do that? What are you going to do, right? Well, one of the things that you can do, and this is something that I did when I first started. I made you know, over six figures in my first five and a half months full time. And I did it almost exclusively through solo ads. And this is exactly what I did to get making money quickly. When you get, so a lot of times people will get opt-ins, right? You'll have a squeeze page set up and you get opt-ins. And then you, all of a sudden you don't get any MTTBs out of it. You're not getting any sales. So I tell my students, you know, or my people on my team, I said, you know, put an autoresponder message in there just telling people to email you if you have questions, right? You just put an email. If you have any questions, just hit reply, and I'll make sure that I can answer them, okay? Now, if you're nervous about that, I'm going to get to that in a second too, but this is important because you're going to find out a lot of times people will respond or they will respond to you. So now you can take these opt-ins you're already getting. You may have 100 opt-ins or a thousand and you have no sales yet well try doing this let people know that you're there to help if you have any questions just hit reply back to me and I'll be more than happy to address or answer your questions so use the leads that you're getting so here's some things that you can do you can shoot videos and give away value that shows that you're not going I mean that you're not just going for their money or right, so masterminds going to live events where you can meet other partners are great places to shoot video, right? So somebody may be like, "Well, I'm not. I'm a little nervous about shooting video. I'm not, you know, I'm oof, oof, shooting video. Maybe I'll take a picture, but not a video." I remember one of the last masterminds I went to. I this 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 lady uh, had come up to me and said, "You know, I, I like the things you're saying, but I can't shoot videos. I'm scared to death to shoot videos." And I told her, "Listen, I want you to shoot me three videos. I don't care what it is." I want you to shoot me three videos uh, within the next, uh, I think I said five hours, something like that. But by the time we get to dinner, I want to see these five, uh, three videos. And then she comes back late and said, listen, I shot 10 of them. Shot 10 videos. All right? So as hard as you think it may be, you just need to get one. Get one under your belt. Okay? And and uh, use some of the ones that you see, uh, you know, like uh, from Ask Matt Lloyd and all these different things that you see uh, um, that the partners putting on the Mo Facebooks, use them as guides, okay? But you can shoot videos and give value to these people that are in your autoresponder, that are opting into your list. The other thing, you just offer free strategy sessions, okay? So uh, don't worry about what you're going to say and do all and all that. We'll, we'll, we'll get to that in just a few minutes, but I want you to start thinking differently. I, I want you to start not thinking, I am going to just go for commissions, I'm going to go for clicks. You want to help people. I'm hoping that's what people here want to do, right? The purpose of any business, no matter if it's mobile or any business, should be always to help people. If you focus on helping enough people, I, I assure you the money is going to come. If you focus on making money and making sure that's your end, up, end game, I can almost assure you that you're not going to make as much money as you can. So focus on helping people. So when I say offer free strategies, that you can use the same technique. You know, say, listen, uh, today I'm offering 15-minute or 30-minute strategy sessions. All you have to do is hit reply. Here's my calendar link. Just book a time. Boom. Okay, you're going to get people responding to you. The main thing you want to do is you have leads, you have opt-ins, you may not have sales. Okay, and, and this works also, guys, if you have MTTBs, right? Now, I'm not telling you to do phone sales like the phone team does, but I will sh share with you what you can do and say in those in those conversations. But you just want to have people respond in some they It's important for them to know there's a face or a voice behind the emails that you're sending, right? 
So, um, you know, the strategy session can be 15 minutes if you don't want to make it too long, but you're just trying to get people to see, hey, there's somebody that wants to help me. All right, so offer free strategy sessions. Great way. You can start a Facebook group, okay, invite people to join. So in the back of people, some of the people on this call, you may be like, man, I still don't know what to say. I'm still a little nervous. I don't know. I don't know like talking to people. I get sweaty palms. I start losing my breath. I start doing this. I'll get, trust me, I'm going to go over how to get over all those things, okay? I'm just giving you ideas on just how you can start providing value and content into people's lives that can let them see a different you. So you can start a Facebook group, invite them to join the Facebook group, and then you can share valuable content within your group. And then the guys, remember we said you want to be a problem solver because you're a business owner? So that's what you want to do. You want to find out what their needs are. Ask questions. That's how you find those needs and then you become that problem solver. So contact is key, but you do not have to sell MLR. And this is what I want to tell you. For people thinking, well, I don't know how to do it like the phone team does. Okay, or you may be thinking, well, I've got leads that are MTTB that are already in the system. Um, the phone coach is already probably talking them to them. Is it, will, will I hurt that process? Uh, you know, will I jeopardize a sale? So, you know, in those, okay, there's, there's two scenarios. One is if you're just trying to get people joining to get to the MTTB, right? And the other is if you have people that are MTTB that are not buying. So for the first scenario, all you want to do is you want to get people on the phone, and I'm going to show you how you can become an instant expert. I call it the 1% rule. I'm going to talk about that in just a minute. But I'm going to show you that you don't have to know everything about everything, right? But you're not there to sell MLR to people. You are there to be a voice, to, to hear what their questions are and just be a voice to address that and get them into the funnel. Okay, so you can say something like, you know, you, you know, uh, Tammy, that's a, that's a great question. Uh, what else did you want to find out? Okay, great. Awesome. Well, let me, let me offer you this advice. When I first started in this business, I was kind of like where you're at. I didn't know which direction to go. I didn't know where to turn. I got great coaching and support uh, when I joined Mo. What I like to do is share a link with you, okay? And again, if it's if you're okay with this, if you're comfortable, I just want to share a link with you. It's the same video that I saw when I started, and it's a way for you to get your own one-on-one -on -one coach for just 49 bucks. If you don't like anything that you hear, you get your money right back. Does that, does that sound fair? All right? So you're not there to sell a 24.97 product. You're there just to talk to people and get them. At that point, when you're providing value to people, it makes more sense for them to go to the MTTB link rather than you just throwing that link out there in the first place. All right, does that make sense, guys? Uh, are we getting a lot of yeses there? Does that make sense? Boop, boop, boop. Everybody. Okay, there we go. Yes. Yeah, we're good. Okay, good. Yeah. Okay, so, so, so this is the thing. You, you have to just start doing, look at doing things a little bit differently. See, don't sit there and go, man, I don't, I'm, I'm not sure if this works because I'm not getting any sales. See, I'm here to tell you that it works. It really does work. Um, but you have to find a way to make it work for you. And I'm trying to share some ideas here because you want to just start doing different things, but it should make sense to you. The things that I'm asking you to do should really make sense to you. So how can you do this, right? Well, here's some keys. First off, you want to narrow your target market. Okay, there's a saying that if you advertise to the masses, you advertise to no one. Okay, it's very important you remember that. If you advertise to the masses, you advertise to no one. It's better to get a specific market that you want to work with. Do you want to go with to stay-at-home moms, to baby boomers? Um, you know, is it a specific uh, 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 demographic in terms of a location? You, you want to find, and they call this developing a customer avatar. I'm not really going to go deep into that. You can just Google that if you want. But you want to make sure that instead of going out and trying to bring everybody into MOBE, it's better to focus on a segment and then try to provide as much value as you can to that market. It, it could be something that you're, if you're a stay-at-home mom, you want to, may want to market, market other stay-at-home moms. If you're a single parent, you may want to market other single parents, right? If you're a baby boomer, again, these are just ideas. But, you, I mean, you don't have to be in that class. 
Um, sometimes it helps because you know the mindset that those individuals are going through because you're going through them yourself. You don't have to, but I, it's important to, to narrow it down and niche it down. And with Facebook, it's very easy to do that. Facebook's one of the best mediums on there, but you could do it from other mediums also. Here's the other thing I want to challenge you guys to do. Work every day, every day. I have it programmed into my Google Calendar. I have it set on repeat, so it repeats every day. Work every day to produce one piece of content, whether it's taking pictures, creating a blog post, videos. Okay? I want you to start getting out of the mindset of, I just need to just go out there and do ads and promote my link. And I want you to start finding ways to make people's lives better, to show them what, how, why MOB is great. Because, see, y'all all, all are, are all in MOB. If you're into masterminds, you know how amazing the masterminds are. You know how amazing this, this, the, the support network is. Well, we need to give these other individuals a chance to find that, right? So if you just put a link out there, all these things can be missed. I mean, I've had people that told me, oh, my gosh, I never knew how great this business was. People just kept sending me links, and I was like, this is just another one of those Internet marketing things. I am just floored, and I need to get this message out to as many people as possible. That's what they told me. So if that one person is saying, guess what? There's more than that one person out there. So work every day to produce one piece of content that you can use to create value and bring uh, you know, that content and help people uh, change their lives. And this thing, guys, don't try to sell people. To work on just talking to them. And I'm going to share more on how you can do this uh, you know, towards the end, but I'm going to, I have a way to make it so easy for everybody on this call, and you're going to be absolutely shocked how simple it is. But I don't want you, I want you to get out of the habit, or I'm sorry, the mindset that you have to sell people or trick them into doing so. You don't. You don't. You want to do it just the way that you want it done to you. And also work on figuring out what the needs are. Okay, this target market, if it's a baby boomer, if it's a single parent, if it's stay-at-home mom, whatever the, the, the market, you find out what their problems are, what their needs are. Because you have to make sure that you have a solution for that need. If you don't have a solution for what their need is, you know, why would they join you? Get, and then guys, do this. Get people on the phone. Get them on the phone. I know for this, for some people, they're like, oh my gosh, I joined Moe because I didn't want to get on the phone. Okay? Well, ideally, if you have a good funnel set up, if you're getting good quality traffic into the funnel, you don't really have to worry about that. But here's the thing. A lot of times people take shortcuts. And, you know, they don't do split testing. They don't do all things that we ask them to do. They do shortcuts. So what I'm trying to let you know is when you first start, I mean, if you look at, uh, you know, if you have both hands in front of you right now and you put one hand down and one hand up, you know, the, what I tell people is when you first get started, most people don't have as much money to invest like in traffic and all that, but you have something called time. And that's what's on your right. If you have your right hand up and your left hand down, your time is up there. You're going to find as you start making more money, those hands are going to switch places. And when you are making a lot of money, time is a premium, right? So, I mean, I'm making really good money with Moab now, and my time is valuable. I want to spend time with my family. So I outsource a lot of things, right? But when people start, it's good for you to get on the phone and do these little things because that's how you're going to learn. Uh, to me, that's really the best way to learn because you're just getting on the phone. If you're scared to death of it, get on the phone. Just get on the phone, okay? And, again, I'm going to show you what to say and all those type of things. You don't have to worry about it. But you remember, you're not selling people. You are just getting them on the phone and talking to them. Use the resources that you have around you. Moab's got a ton of resources. I know a lot of people in the internet marketing space, and I know the stuff they use for support. Nobody can touch what we have with the webinars, the Traffic Masters Academy, the coaching, the masterminds, the live events where you can get one-on-one -on -one coaching. Nothing can, you know, there's nothing close to that. So use those resources around you. And, and as I said earlier, when you use Facebook, Facebook's one of the best mediums out there. You know, people tell me, man, TG, uh, I, that MOB link is, is banned. Uh, I mean, I can't just go out and promote it. And I tell people, listen, even if it wasn't banned, why would you want to put your link there? Why would you just want to put your link and hope people click and something ha magical happens? Why don't you just try to add value from something different? You know, just offer them something like I did, you know, uh, uh, three – uh, things that's going to do X, Y, Z to you. Offer them a free training video, right? So focus on value creation and lead with a content-based offer 
content based offer, don't go for the quick clicks, guys. Do not go for the quick buys. And contrary to popular thought, solo ads are not dead. They are not dead, okay? Uh, again, you have to be careful because there's some solo ad providers. You just have to be really careful about that. But you have to ask yourself, why do people stay on those lists? Why do they stay on those lists? Why are they getting all these emails? Because they want one of these programs to work. They want something to work so they don't have to keep staying on these lists, right? Does that make sense? So they're not dead, but you have to change the approach, and you, you have to test, obviously, but you have to change your approach, your mindset in dealing with people, okay? So here's the thing, guys. A comfort zone is a beautiful place, but nothing ever grows there. Okay, I want you to challenge yourself. I want you truly to challenge yourself to see if you can leave this comfort zone. Now, why is it so important to leave this comfort zone? Why? <laughs> why? <laughs> this is why. There's your comfort zone. But look where the magic happens. There's your comfort zone. Look where the magic happens. So guys, if you don't leave your comfort zone, are you going to be able to get to where the magic happens? All right? So I want you to think about it. And, you know, I'm not saying do, turn to doing full-time phone sales and do all these other things. I'm telling you to do things to get your business going. You are going to be learning. Life is a learning process, right? You have one kid, and then you have two, three, or four. You're going to know a lot more when you have that fourth child than you did that first. It's, it's life. The way that you drive when you're going you know, through the driving test, 20 years down the road, you're getting from point A to B without even doing what you even did. So just do small things and learn from it. Use it as a learning experience. And I will tell you, from because I do high-ticket phone sales, that people want to know that there is somebody there to help them. Just like you would, right? You would want to know that somebody's there to help you. So always put yourself in people's shoes. Get out of that comfort zone. So here's a 1% rule that I tell people about. 1%. This is what I call the 1% expert rule. If you know 1% more than the next person, you're an expert. I'm going to say it again. If you know 1% more than the next person, you're an expert. Because when people tell me, well, I don't know how to buy creating videos. I don't know what kind of value can I add to people's lives. I just started myself, right? So tell me in the chat box if, if, if that's going through your mind, that how can you be an expert when you're just starting out? What are people writing, Tammy? Uh, Does anybody else think that they're not an expert because they're just starting out or they yeah, don't think they're they saying, yeah, sure, very true, yeah. Yeah. So here's the thing. You want to start looking at what you have around you guys. You all have access to materials that's going to give you a 1% head start over the next person. See, if you're in mode, or let's say you're MLR, you go to your back office, you've got products already there, right? You've already got the, the four bonus products you get when you start, you know, outsourcing secrets, how to build an email marketing empire. Matt Lloyd creates this Ask Matt Lloyd website. Where it's like 150 videos back there. So if you know just a little bit more than the next person, you are an expert. I want you to change the way that you look and think about this. Because if you're thinking you need to know everything about everything before you can share and add value to people's lives, guys, you're missing out on so much. You're missing out on so much commissions and sales you can make because you're because somebody else is going to provide that value. Remember, our top affiliate's making six figures a week. So somebody's joining Mo. Well, those individuals, and he's a good friend of mine, and I talked to him, and I know what he does, and he's doing exactly what I'm telling you guys. He is transforming people's lives by offering value. He's not getting a million clicks out there and then people are joining. No, he is adding value. He's sharing content. He's sharing videos. He's sharing blog posts. He's sharing pictures. He's doing these things, I'm telling you. So go to an Ask Matt Lloyd, and he'll tell you about uh, you know, how to drive traffic. And you watch that video, and you write down notes. And guess what? You can take that and create your own video now. You can create a blog post. We have so many resources. We have a Traffic Masters Academy back there. 
you all should have been through that. If you haven't, uh, depending where you're in the coaching phase, I don't want to just speak out of turn and tell you to go there, but eventually you'll have access to it if you get to a license right level. And there's content there. Take that content and, and use that to be an expert. So I want you, if you think you can start doing that, write I can into the chat box. Write down I can. I want to get at least 25 I can's, Tammy. Let's see if we can get 25. Okay, I can't I even count that fast. They're all coming okay. in. <laughs> okay, good. Good. That's because I want you guys to start looking at things differently. You absolutely know more than the new person who's never heard of MOAB coming in, and that's what you do. That is how you add value. When you go to a, a home business summit, you go to a mastermind, you know, shoot a video with, uh, you know, get asked one of the partners there who are successful. You say, hey, listen, can I shoot a three-minute video with you? What are the top three things you would tell somebody that's just starting out in internet marketing? Or why do you think you succeeded where others have failed? You know, there's so many things that you can do, and I want to challenge you to do one of these every day. Every day. Okay? If you can't, if, if it, your, your work doesn't allow it, do one every other day. Okay, or if you have to do one a week, you know, I mean, one a week is probably, you want to do it more frequently than that, okay? I would, if you could do one every other day, that would, or if you could shoot maybe two or three videos in one day, that would be awesome, right? So use that knowledge of being the expert by doing the 1%, okay? And that's a, that's a name tag. I forgot about that. Put the name tag. Hello, I am the expert because you definitely are. So guys, this is, I mean, what the business is going through is absolutely amazing. I mean, when I started, we were doing a few hundred thousand dollars a month, you know, and now we're doing, you know, months with over $5 million. It's just absolutely amazing what's going on with the business. So it's going in the right direction. If anyone's thinking, did I make a right decision by joining Mo? You absolutely did. This is an amazing business to be a part of, and we're not going anywhere. We're getting, now with the events arm, because Matt just did a, um, a video I believe was today where somebody asked them, you know, well, what is the best way to get started? Well, you've got not just the MTTV, but you've also got events, right? You got the I Am Freedom events to do too. So this is an explosive phase that we're going, phase we're going through. So guys, a business like this is hard to find. It really is. So don't worry, oh man, I've been doing this for weeks or a month and I'm not getting results. Well, now that's what I'm here. I'm here to start changing that shift. I mean, change the mindset, making towards you that shift. Because this type of business, I see what's out there. I know a lot of people in this space. It's just not that easy to find. I want to be doing this to you. This is a few years back when Brian was not the general That's the general manager of Mo, Brian Price. I want to be at one of these events handing you one of those checks. I absolutely know that you guys can do it. I, I do. I don't waste my time saying if I don't if I thought oh my gosh just there's just no way so and so can do this you absolutely can do that now is it going to be a bigger jump for some people than others absolutely absolutely but I always talk to them, listen how comfortable do you want to be do you want to be comfortable do you want to be broke you know ask yourself that so if if you're if you're where you're at or if where you're at's not where you want to be you got to do something to make that change. I've given you a ton of content here, and you know, uh, Tammy's recording this. So you'll have access to it later to take a look at. Also, it'll be posted in one of the uh, Facebook groups. Um, but yeah, just make sure that you take these notes, review them uh, off of your calendar, and then start implementing. Okay? So, so we don't have a whole lot of time. I don't want to, because I know we've gone on for a little bit. But this is what I wanted to do. I, I mean, I mean, Tammy kind of hit, hinted on it earlier. I. I created a product, and it's actually interesting how this product came to be, but it's called the either No Pressure Sales System, and one of my heroes growing up was T.J. Rolator. He's a marketing legend. He's made over $150 million in, I believe, 20 years or so, a little bit over 20 years, and I became friends with him, and when he found out the way that I viewed certain things in terms of selling, he said, listen, you have got to share this with people and change their lives, because I, now one of the reasons he felt like this was because he had his own phone sales team, and he taught sales totally differently. But when he starts sharing what I was teaching with his team, his sales were going through the roof. So he said, listen, we need to make a product out of this, and we need to change people's lives, and that's what we did. So the, 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 the program is called How to Be a Sales Superstar, Make a Ton of Money, or Make Tons of Without an Ounce of Pressure. All right, And, and Chris Lakey is his, uh, his stepson-in-law. And TJ, we, we did, and what we did is we did an interview series where he interviewed me for four hours, 
and he asks you all types of questions. So now, now the program, and if you want to put that in the chat box, um, Tammy, but the, you can get the program at, at mob.com forward slash no pressure. And I spent a lot of time to put this together because I wanted to literally, like he said, change people's lives. Now, I mean, it's just 97 bucks. It's not, you know, I mean, it, people tell me it should be valued more than that. It's just 97 bucks. And it literally changes people's lives. Uh, Lance Callahan said it's the finest sales program that he's ever made. You know, he's confident that he's going to be able to, you know, uh, triple the production in the next 30 days. You know, Greg, who I actually had a chance to do a, a, a little one-on-one -on -one session with him, uh, he said he had a new guy that started his uh, um, started with uh, his company and never had done sales before. Use follow my techniques, and he made 31,000 plus in four days. And he knows just the tip of the iceberg. So I, I mean, I know this product, and the things we talked about within this last hour, it's all covered in there to literally change your life. So, so here's some of the things that you're going to be getting with the. And I'm going to move this thing out of the way again. This is I can't really see it. So Tammy, did you get a chance to put that link over the side too? Uh, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm having trouble with uh, with my go-to webinar. So as soon as it pops back up, I'll put it in there. Okay. <laughs> All right, so it's just, it's just mobe.com forward slash no pressure. But here's some of the things you're going to learn with the MPSS, pro, the, the MPSS just no pressure sales system. So here's some of the things that you're going to be getting. You're going to learn how to get the right prospects to come to you. Okay, so I'm going to, the people that have sweaty palms, the people that are nervous to get anyone on the phone, I'm going to share with you how to get those right prospects to come to you without worrying about all that. How you're not going to get objections and really have your future customers sell themselves. Really, really, that's what you're going to learn with certain aspects of the program. The secret of maximizing profits from each individual customer. So instead of going out and getting a bunch of customers that get MLR, wouldn't it be nice if you have customers that get a license rights, gets titanium, gets a platinum, maybe even a diamond, right? So I'm going to share with you how I maximize those profits from each individual customer. Also see how to take away your future customers' pain because that's really what you're doing. You're trying to, you're finding a way to solve a problem and at the same time increase your commissions. Also learn how to show your prospects that it's in their best interest to join. Okay, so at the end of your conversations, I'm going to share with you how you're going to get them to get to go to that $49 product and get them into the system. Or if you're going to do TTI, how you can even take a little, a little bit further. Okay, find out what little things can produce absolutely big results that and eventually leads to more sales. And you're also going to learn why those old school, you know, hard, hardcore closing techniques, they just don't work much anymore. Okay? We don't use that type of system at all. It's not about making people feel bad or belittling them and alternative clothes and all those things you may have learned about. This is a lot different. In fact, you'll learn gentle questions that hit your future customers' hot buttons. And you also want to get um, the, the top objection. I actually spent one whole audio on this. The main objection concerns that you're going to get from people and really how to, you know, just really how to deal with them. Go learn how to sell people without making them feel that they've been sold. Really, it's a good, it's a good end result. Everybody feels a w true win-win situation. People are really happy at the end of your interactions, and you know, discover how to help people feel, make them feel good. That's exactly what I'm talking about. And, and this is the big key. Most people, yeah, I don't know if you realize, but most people, when there's two people talking, you only listen 10% of the time. They've done studies on this, and it shows 45% of the time when two people are talking that one person is thinking of what to say and another 45% of the time they're thinking about when they can butt in. So you're only being heard 10% of the time. I'm going to show you how just making this simple tweak is going to literally change your business, change it by listening 100% of the time. And I've got a secret in equation that I developed is V is greater than P equals S. I'm going to share what those letters stand for. What dig questions are and how easy they are to make to, to use to increase money. Um, how less effort can actually lead to more sales, and just really a lot more. And guys, I'm going to be. Uh, there's a bonus that I'm, I'm do offering. It's just for today. This is not offered with a regular course. Um, so it's like it's $97 for the course. But if you do this, uh, do it today. I'm offering this, uh, and this really has a real world value of at least $5,000. You can you can listen to what I'm going to say. You can make that evaluation yourself. But a few years back, I'm sorry, it was last year in Costa Rica, I was talking at a high-end mastermind 
um, I, I believe was our uh, platinum mastermind in Costa Rica. John Chow, who you probably know, one of the top earners, Shakir Hussein, myself, eight other top internet marketers, we were speaking from stage and we were asked to share with the audience and the audience had to pay at least eighteen thousand dollars just to be there per person but we had to share with them what we would do to make ten thousand dollars in ten days with no list no contacts just a laptop so which basically we're starting from new so we're stuck in a desert only way we could come up off, off the desert was to come up with this plan so there was ten people that shared what they would do and we have it all recorded for you guys if you just take one idea from one of these you can literally transform the way you're running your mo business today okay so this bonus is only for today so um, so guys what, what you want to do is the, I'm going to stick the link here um, again it's uh, mobe.com forward slash no pressure and to get the special bonus what you're going to do is once you do the order for the ninety seven dollars um, it'll uh, give you a receipt you're going to get a receipt mail to you just forward that receipt to marketplace at mobe.com with the receipt just email them and let them know that you bought the uh, the no pressure selling system and um, they will give you the access to that bonus okay again I'm not making a big strong pitch for it I mean because I, it's just so uh, to me it's underpriced because it's a uh, to me it's a fair let me change this it's it's a fair price um, I know that you know sometimes you don't have access to thousands of dollars, but 97 is fair for the time that I put in and what you're going to get out of it. it you know, you start implementing, and it, to put it this way: let's say that you're not getting any conversions now, and you learn from this how to just get one person to get into that $49 product, and that person just goes and gets MLR. Well, you're getting $1,250 just for that one conversion, extra conversion happening, and I feel so confident with you being able to do that if you implement that that I, I think it's really fair so uh, I, uh, what I want to do is while people are putting in their orders uh, Tammy are there any questions that are popped up that maybe I can I maybe have time for maybe one or two questions uh, before because I don't want to, to drag on for too much longer but I know that there was some questions you said that were coming through are there any questions that maybe have been popping up more than others that I can address really quickly um, well, my my machine is still locked up, so I'm not able to look at too many of the, the questions right now in the box, but um, let me see which ones from earlier uh, there might have been. Um, I know that uh, there were a couple questions on, um, <clears throat> there was a question on for the uh, solo ads. Um, they were asking, how do you target market? Um, with solo ads, or is that you know something that um, that you would have to do separately? Yes, yeah, solo ads targeting is not. I mean, it's it's just so much more difficult. Um, Facebook, you can actually break down into a specific demographic. You can niche it down very much. Solo ads, you can't really. Uh, you can get what they call T1 traffic, tier one traffic, where it goes to most of the uh, English speaking countries. But what you can do is you can actually take a big group and make sure that your offer, your specific offer, is for a specific demographic. And then you can actually take a big group and niche them down that way. It's harder to tar target um, like you can on Facebook with solo ads or other you know, uh, traffic strategies. There are the, the Traffic Masters Academy in your back office. Uh, I believe there's one on solo ads that Shakir did that will give you the more depth on that. Uh, but in terms of targeting, there's really no way to target um, unless there's some kind of software has been developed. But what I would suggest is if you do have a big, like you know, 500 click or 1,000 clicks that are going out after you test it, you know, in smaller quantities, uh, make sure your offer is to a specific demographic. And guess what? The people that are on your list will be exactly the demographic that you want to go after. Okay. So a little more expensive, uh, but it still can be effective. All right. Well, thank you so much, TG. Um, I, I'm not sure what's going on with my um, with the chat box here and why it's locked up on me like this, but um, but um, that that was great. Thank you so much for being here tonight um, and answering everyone's questions. Um, if anyone does have a question that I'm sorry that I can't I can't see right now, if you want to just email the uh, marketplace at mob.com and I'll I'll try to get your questions answered. I'm, again, I'm real sorry that. 
for whatever reason, my, my chat box is frozen. So. Okay, awesome. Yeah, yeah, Tammy, yeah, Tammy, that's a great idea. So, yeah, if you have a question <clears throat> uh, that you want me to address, well, there's, there's two things you can do. One is you can actually uh, send that email, uh, but just so that doesn't get too overwhelmed, uh, if you want to drop a, a comment into one of the Facebook groups, because uh, there is a uh, there should be something in the license rights, the titanium and the platinum Facebook groups. If you want to drop a comment, even if you enjoy the webinar, you just want to tell me that you got a lot out of it, uh, just drop a comment in there. If you have a question, uh, just drop that question there also. I'll, I'll try to see if I can address it. Um, but I really do hope you guys got a lot of value. Uh, if you implement, guys, I know that this can literally transform and transform your business. Uh, it's really hard for me within an hour to get really detailed and specific on every strategy. That's why I did try to give you as many ideas as I, as I could. You can take it deeper. If you have a coach you're working with, you can take it deeper with them. If you come to events like the masterminds, especially if I'm there, you know, feel free to come up and, and talk to me. I'm more than happy to see how much more depth I can give you. But there's other resources you guys can use to, uh, you know, to, to get a lot of them, you know, a lot of that deeper. But if you want to drop a note, you know, let me know how you enjoy the webinar. If you have a question, just drop it in there, and I will try to you know, see if I can get those addressed by tomorrow. Okay. But again, it's moog.com forward slash no pressure. It'll take you right to the order page. You just uh, give your information there. Uh, it's just ninety-seven dollars, and then uh, you'll get the receipt email to you. Make sure you forward that to marketplace at moog.com. And we will get the uh, that that special bonus uh, out to you um, as soon as we receive. Well, actually, I think that'll be done by tomorrow. But but it'll be timestamped. So just make sure you do that tonight, and we'll get that bonus out to you really no later than tomorrow. Okay. Yep. All right. Thank you so much, TG, uh, for coming on again, and um, and thank you everyone for for listening. Stay in tuned, and uh, we we really enjoyed everything that TG had to say. So thank you for being here tonight. All right. You're very welcome, Tammy. Thanks, guys. Uh -huh. Have a good night. All right. Good night.